So, Doge and crypto is crashing, and you want to know how you can make money when everything's going down. But you totally can't. This is called short selling. I'm going to show you where and how you do this, and I'm going to explain how it works. I'm also going to show you what I've been doing all day, making this video with my short positions, making money the entire time, while, as you can see, everything is crashing. That's gold. All the crypto is crashing. So short selling is when you make money while an asset or crypto or stock is going down. This usually occurs because an investor like you has borrowed that asset. And during the time of that loan, the value of the asset you borrowed has gone down. So you may have borrowed a thousand dollars worth of an asset, but by the time you go to pay it back or the time you choose to pay it back, it only costs 500. Congratulations. You just made money on a short like I've been doing all day. You can freeze this if you want to read the definitions, but let me just show you how this shit works. I opened three different positions on three different sites at three different margins today within the last six hours. Just to show you, this is my favorite site where I have by far made the most money and it's called Phoenix. Earlier today, um, I made a $426 short sale. I sold in at 35.5 cents. Doge is now 32 cents. That's a three cent drop or a 10% difference roughly. This investment has more than doubled. Even though I, I have a 130% gain, even though Doge has only changed 10%, my gain is over a hundred percent because I'm on a 15 times margin. Now the risk there is that I sold in or bought at 35.5 cents at a short sale. So if Doge goes up to 37.7 cents at any time during this position, this money will be liquidated and go away. You lose it. But in the meantime, look at all these nice gains while everyone else is losing money. These big red lines have now just become money makers for you. Every exchange and platform is different in the way they work and what they allow you to do. Femix is a, a platform where you can only have one position in one direction. It, they offer one to 20 times margins for Doge and cross margins. So if I wanted to mix in different currencies and have one position that's kind of all tethered together, so I'm not completely at risk from one huge, if there is one huge purchase or sale in Doge, that could break my margin position. But if I'm, if I cross margin with other currencies like Ether and there wasn't a huge sale in Ether, that diffuses the responsibility between your different assets and usually helps you survive. Now, Phoenix does not allow you to have more than one position. Okay, I can't have multiple entry points of Doge. If I add to Doge right here, which I'll do, I'm just going to do a tiny, I'm just going to add one little, just one little market price to Doge. That will change my liquidation price. It just went from 3775 to 3773. Some websites, like this one, allow you to have multiple calls directions see now i have multiple i have a, a long position and i have multiple short positions and this website offers up to 50 times margin which the higher the margin the tighter your liquidation point which let's go over here's a little cheat sheet for your liquidation prices if you use a 50 times margin you have a 2% window from where you can enter. Let's look. I entered, look, I entered 34 cents right here. If this goes up 2%, I'll be liquidated. Actually, if it goes up 2.5%, I'll be liquidated. But this website, another difference is it actually stops your loss at 80%. It also stops your profit at 500%. So you can't make more than five times your gain. I, Every, I always, this is, this is not investing. This is a gambling site. And I will leave this on the background or a second screen while I'm working at my computer. And I mean, you just make money like this. I mean, like here's a $50 bet I made 
earlier, 33.4 cents. It's now 32.5 cents. Doge drop two cents. And I have more than doubled my money. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter who you are or how much money you have. What I'm showing you can make anyone rich. You don't need a lot of money. In fact, you shouldn't use a lot of money because that's a point of margin trading. You turn a little bit of money into a lot. You can lose any amount, but there's an infinite amount that you can gain. So why do you need a lot of money to play with? Start with a little and keep your winners. Like I said, every exchange and platform is different with their fees, their rules, um, their options. Um, here's a brand new site. This is the biggest money making site I think I've ever found. I just found it today though. This is a 500 times margin site and it's not easy to use. This is the most advanced thing I'm going to show you. I'm, I'm going to show this at the very end of the video, how to use it. Okay. This is, this platform is MetaTrader, but this is crypto rocket. I made one bet on this site. I made one purchase on this site and I only used $35 of the hundred that I started out with. And it's up a thousand times gain. That $35 short sale is profited $285 while Doge is going down. And the entry price was 35.9 and Doge is now 32.8. So a three cent drop at 500 times margin. Now let's get into some of the details on how this shit works and how to actually place the order so you don't get fucked. Different ways of short selling. All right. The sites that I just showed you are basically what I like. This is a made up term. This is what I like to call direct leverage. One click trading. One click bets. This is immediate leverage positions. No borrowing or loans required. You're not picking an interest rate. You're not picking someone to borrow from and all that. So where you're going to get these one click situations like Bygomics, uh, you know, you get a tweet alert that someone just said some shit about Doge and you want to jump on real fast and just long Doge to the moon. You can just, you log in and you just, you just start pressing this button. That's how easy it is to place an order. I'm going to go over the fees later. You never want to do market purchases unless it's just a huge rocket. You got to get on real fast. So this is the top of the spike right here. So I'm going to, I'm going to place some orders. Three, three, three. Uh, I'm going to make a short sale for there. Three, three, four, three, three, five. So I'm placing a staggered list of orders on this chart. So that if Doge goes up, the higher Doge goes, the more I buy. And it's going to make more and more positions. And then on the way down, like, I'll take some of my higher ones. And you can adjust and make it auto sale for you. So this is basically your, they call this, the SL means stop loss and the TP means take profit. Take profit means automatically sell at a, for your profit and stop loss means Prevents you from getting liquidated, which this site does. It forces you to stop loss at 80%. It's the most you can lose. So now we have this back on a downtrend, right? So I can take, I can adjust my, t the max I can gain is 500. If Doge is 33.1 cents right now, I bought this at 33.2. If Doge goes to 29.9 cents, this is going to give me a 500 times gain. It only has to move like three cents and you're going to get a 500 times gain. If it goes to 33.8, I'll lose it all. But I've been watching this chart for a while and I've seen the resistance lines and I don't think it's going to go past there. I also don't think it's going to go to 29.9 very soon. So I'm going to look at this chart and be pick a spot. I know it's going to hit for however, however long I want to be sitting at the computer watching it basically. So I'm going to pick 32.4. So I just looked at the chart. The idea of leverage tokens are basically tethered to a price proportional of the asset it's named after. For instance, Doge has 
some five times long tokens and some five times short tokens. And the idea is basically that the price of that token should be five times higher than the price of Doge. So if Doge goes up 10 cents, this is going to go up. If Doge goes up 10%, this is going to go up 50%. What's great about these tokens, especially for beginners, is there's no chance of liquidation. With Doge especially, leverage tokens are awesome because Doge is very volatile and Doge never really goes down. It just goes higher later. Doge has definitely crashed, but it's after every crash has been an all-time high this year of 2021. So it's risky to margin or contract trade because you can liquidate and lose all of it. But if, if you really can't risk losing that, I mean, you'll never liquidate if you buy these tokens. Let's, let's take a look at one. So the way these tokens work are different on different exchanges. Uh, and they're also pretty rare, especially for, uh, the USA looks like for Doge specifically, you can get them on FTX maybe, um, Binance.com has it, which the USA won't be allowed to get. I'll put this link in, in the description so you can read about how the rebalancing works. The price of a leveraged token is not going to, it's going to adjust every 24 hours and it's basically sometimes going to screw you. Um, so these are not recommended to hold for long term. These are for day trading. Uh, so now I'm going to show you how actual margin trading works, which is more difficult than the what I call direct leverage. Margin trading involves depositing into an exchange that offers a margin trading account and transferring the funds from your spot or your trading account into your margin account. So this is an exchange that offers margins and it's also the only exchange I can find with perpetual 50 times margin Doge trading. This Bygomic site I've been using all day has 50 times margin for Doge, but it maxes out. It's not perpetual. It maxes out at 500 times gain. Perpetual means never ending. So you can have a bet going on this site and it will never stop if Doge never keeps going. up. Never stops going up. Now, the first step you need to do is just log in, go to your assets and go to deposit. You can deposit any currency you want and there will be a way to get it into your margin account, even if it's not a margined asset. I'm going to deposit a USDT ERC20 type, which is usually what it is. I'm going to go over here to the uh, Bygomics site I've been using all day. Send exactly 100 USDT to CoinX, which does have margin trading. All right, I finally put a small uh, deposit in an exchange so I can show you, so I can walk you through the process of a real margin trading setup. Obviously the first step would be deposit into your exchange. And when you do that, your balances go to your spot accounts or your main accounts, and you need to go to your assets and find your margin account and transfer into that. Um, and then you would want to short something that is high that you think is going down and use that USDT to invest somewhere else, hopefully. So, uh, here is, this is the, if you know, Doge is just going to skyrocket. This is the place where you can get endless gains somewhat safely. I mean, 500 times also I'll show you at the end, but, uh, that's harsh. So I have deposited a couple of different tiny amounts of stuff here just to show you like what you have to deal with. Okay. So I, I put Dogecoin in here. You need to go to your, you need to find your margin account. And this is the universal symbol for like exchange. So from my spot to my margin account, I want to move the doge that I have. So I'll just type that in and you have to pick the pair that you want to work with. So doge is going down right now and dollars are not Bitcoin is going down. So I could short doge and hold dollars and I'd be in a better situation. So that's what I'm going to do in order to do that. You transfer into your margin account. Now that it's in my margin account, I can borrow these currencies, but you have to deposit equity in order to borrow. So now that I've deposited some Doge, they're going to let me borrow some Doge. 
So now I'll have even more Doge. Now this doesn't help me yet. Now I just have more Doge, and if Doge is going down, that's pretty bad. So then, once you borrow your asset, you need to work with it. Is it high right now? Or are you, sh you just borrowed it because it's going down, right? So you're going to want to get rid of it. So I would go, you go to exchange, you know, wherever the markets are. Um, on exchange platforms, you'll see spot trading and margin trading. So if you pick a currency, so I want to trade Doge. Once you pick it, there'll be like contract or futures, spot and margin. I'm in the margin. I want to get rid of this Doge because it's going down and I will owe them less money in order to buy back this 200 Doge I own. It'll cost less money. Now, I guess I should go over the limit and uh, here the maker taker fees are the same, so it actually doesn't matter. But next I'm going to go over the fees and the differences between placing a limit and a market order because some places it's actually some places actually pay you 0.25% to place limit orders. I have just placed a market order to sell all this doge and now I have 100 USDT. So I still owe them the same amount of doge, but as the price drops, it'll be cheaper to buy it back. Um, some exchanges will let you trade with this right away and just start buying other currencies. Coinex doesn't until you have profit to work with. From what I can tell. Another thing Coinex has is perpetual future contracts. And this is actually the best part about Coinex. It's the only place I've been able to find uh, for the USA with 50 times Doge future contracts. The site I showed you earlier, Bygomics, offers 50 times contracts for Doge, but they max out at 500 times gains. Here on CoinEx, there is no limit to the amount that you can gain. If Doge goes from 25 cents to a dollar and you're on a 50 times spot, man, you would turn $1,000 into like, 150,000, I think. Yeah. <laughs> so if you, to get into your perpetual, you go to your assets, pick your futures account or your perpetual account. I've deposited Bitcoin in there. So it's showing me that I'll go to exchange on the left side. You, this is the contracts platform up here. You see USDT M contracts and coin M contracts usdtm means us dollar tether margin contracts coin m means coin margin contracts this is for bitcoin paired with dollars and this is for if you deposit usdt you use these ones if you deposit usd or bitcoin i you use these ones so i have bitcoin and i think it's going to be i think it's going to go down a little bit more maybe to 31,000 or something again before it really blows up it's 22nd of May today so I would want to sell my Bitcoin and I'm going to show you how to place a limit order there look there are different fees for margin trading future trading and spot trading the margin trading here are the same fees this is futures and they're different Makers are the ones that place orders and they don't get fulfilled instantly. So if you place a limit order, you'll pay a lower fee. If you place a market order, you're going to pay a higher fee. Takers are the ones who place an order, even if it is a limit order, and it's fulfilled instantly. If you place a limit order below market price, you're still going to pay that fee. So this is how you place a proper limit order. Select limit. And then when you go to select your price, one thing you can usually do is click on the order book somewhere and it'll fill in the price for you at the current price. So if you're trying to get it quick, that's one way to help. So there's usually a bar down here to spend like a percentage of your available assets. So I'll spend 50% and I want to short this. I'm going to short this and I want to short it at the highest price possible. Because I'm selling it. You want to sell at the highest price possible. 37790 So I need to put a price just above what it is and hope it gets taken. Here you can see, and it did. It got taken right away. I don't know. I, I'm going to guess 
I didn't pay that fee because as soon as I got that purchase, it was green, which is usually a good sign. Um, I, I have shorted this Bitcoin and the average entry price was 37800 And the liquidation, wow, it's a really high liquidation price. So it must be only, so this is how you select the margin. If I want to keep my Bitcoin trade by itself, I would do isolated. If I want to spread out the risk between multiple currencies, which is what you would want to do if you are entering in a volatile currency and you don't trust your landing position, you can spread out that risk by cross margining with other assets and then selling those assets later on if you don't need them once your position has taken off into a safe space you can add to. Any time that you change this margin, it is going to change your entry price. Now, let me explain the fees a little bit. They're different everywhere, but some places actually pay you, pay you 0.25% to place limit orders. The maker fees are positive. This is the difference. If you have a $10,000 order, this is the difference between placing an order and getting 10,025 and paying us a fee and getting 9,925. This is a 1% difference right here. Okay. And if you're contract trading one, if you are on a 100 times margin, 1% will double your investment. The only time you should place a market order is, is during absolute rockets that no one expected. Cause if you're, not expecting it then you're already too late and you probably shouldn't be doing the margin trading um bygomics is the easiest if you are just looking at doing this for the first time bygomics is the easiest to learn on to show someone to plan out a day like you know say there's some event like saturday night live and you just think there's some type of action bygomics is the short is where you would want to like play on your phone short term playing with the price of doge it's not investments it's a game you can lose and make a ton of money you can even long and short at the same time there it's ridiculous uh femex is the best it's my favorite platform and it's the best cross margin user friendly platform i like how you can place limit orders and really drag them up and down um which by the way femex right now until May 25th, Fenix has up to $2,000 giveaway in contract trading rewards. If you have two Bitcoin somewhere and you just, which is really low now, it was 100,000, now it's only 80. If you have two Bitcoin sitting somewhere and you just move it to Fenix, they will give you $2,000 in trading credit. You can buy future positions with and if it profits then you get to withdraw that money two thousand dollars just from moving to bitcoin here which is like 80 grand what and this is they always have recurring deposit bonuses and they also have a hundred dollar sign up bonus um so the last part i want to show you is this new site that i just found um crypto rocket which is 500 times margin site it is the only place i've ever even heard of that has a 500 times margin at all, much less for Doge and available to the USA. It's kind of hard to sign up, so I'm gonna help you out with it. You can immediately like sign in with Google or Facebook, which I recommend. And when it's gonna ask you to verify your phone number and it's not gonna send you a text message. What has to happen is Crypto Rocket is going to call you. Um. They're from Britain, so they're on. Once they call you, they'll verify uh, the name that they have in the account, and and that's pretty much it. You, they don't need an uh, address, they don't need billing information, they don't need ID. So you verify your email, and then uh, they will call you and to verify your phone, and then you make a deposit of. You can only deposit Bitcoin here. They actually do take wire transfers. Now, just so you know, any. Any website that receives wire transfers is actually, it's kind of a telltale sign that they're 
going to be a little more trustworthy because if they only accept crypto, that means they're not taking any banking responsibilities. So if they are receiving wires, that means, you know, they're a little more identifiable. So this is what the inside of, um, once you have made your deposit, you can make an account with MetaTrader. You're going to click this button and you're going to create a new account. You're going to go to open trading account, pick a currency. Um, you want to do, you may want multiple accounts, but I'm here for the 500. So that's what I made. Um, and it will email you the password. Okay. I just made this account and it's going to email me the login and the password. Now to use the login and the password that they just, um, here's, I'm going to blur these out to use the login that they email you. Um, you simply go to MetaTrader, MT4, or WebTrader on the computer. I have a, the MetaTrader 4 on my phone, so I can do I can do these 500 times. <laughs> That's on my phone. Um, so you would, yeah, you would paste the login and password in this window in order to access your trading account. So you make a deposit and then you create your trading account. It'll email you the password and the login. You just paste your password in, save it. Um, what you see here is the option to, so this is the server. If you, if you log in on your phone, it's going to ask you for the client server. Just start typing crypto rocket. Real crypto rocket real is a real money side and the demo is where you can I suggest playing with the demo so you can see how easy it is to lose your money. But yeah, the demo is uh not not real trade, so this is what the platform looks like. It's it's pretty serious. So let me show you how to place an order. This button right here new order pops up and a market execution is an instant order and a pending order is going to be a limit order so we always want pending unless we're too late and we're missing a rocket like i said if you want a short that's just called a sell and all you do is type in the price see i just clicked here and it, and it gave me the current selling ask um so i'm gonna place an order to short this at three four five and i'm only doing like the smallest i can possibly do just to show you okay here's the orders the bottom so these are all different uh this is the order that I have active. I bought at 35.9 a, a sell and it's down to 34.4 .4. and at a 500 times margin, the profit is, uh, like 600%. It's a 30, $35 bet and it's $140. Look how little it has moved and it's been, it's been here for order. God, almost a day now, almost 24 hours. So hopefully the margin trading takes patience. Um, you don't, you, the dip has to come to you. The dip or the spike has to come to you. I am going to just place one little market order just to have a new order. So I'm going to sell. This site has different separate positions. So it'll show you your whole balance if, if your free margin gets to zero that's when you liquidate so adding more positions can help you or it can hurt you um when you have an open position and you want to close it you would double click on it 
And unless you want to sell it now, market execution is going to sell it now. So make sure you change this to pending order. I'm sorry. You want to change it to a modified order. And these two will automatically sell for you. These two columns right here. Um, take profit is where you want to pick how much money you're going to make. So if I'm shorting this and I entered at 34.12, any, if it's 34, anything below 34.1 is going to be profit even just 34 and I don't ever want this to stop loss because I, I feel like it's safe. So there I've modified that order and now I can see the take profit from the 34.1 entry is set to sell at 33.9. This is how you set up margin trades limits. Um, <clears throat> <laughs> this is MetaTrader, which is one of the more popular like trading platforms, but it is actually pretty complicated to look at um, at first. These are the one minute chart, one hour chart. You can you can see the amount of fluctuation going on right here. It's not much, and it's it's giving me one thousand time fluctuations. Surprisingly, it hasn't liquidated, so. I'm going to start putting multiple orders in like this from roughly the same spot and then selling some of them and having continuous short term short and longs going up and down bouncing while I have farther out longer positions that I don't move until they're extreme. I mean, this. This is over 500%. Like when it's over 1500%, you know, I'll probably sell it if it gets down that low. So that's uh, some basic execution and, you know, limit order strategy, I suppose. Um, like I said earlier, it doesn't matter who you are or how much money you have. This can make you rich. You don't need a lot of money, so don't spend a lot of money. That's the beautiful thing about this is you can take a little bit and turn it into a lot. You can also take a lot and turn it into nothing. You can take a little and turn it into nothing. So just bring a little, and leave with a lot, come back to my videos, and please, the most important part of all of this is that you just click that link in the top of the description for all, all the accounts. Pretty much it. You're welcome.